I'm Camille Berry and I am the Chief Operations Officer for the Girl Scout Council of Colonial Coast. And I'm John Morgan, I'm the Property Director for GSCCC. Uh, locally here at the Girl Scout Council of Colonial Coast, we serve about 16,000 girls. And the Girl Scout Council of Colonial Coast right here in Chesapeake, this is our regional program center where we serve um, a, a very large amount of girls. Girls can come together from all over the area and uh, enjoy our outback, enjoy now the new pool, the pool facility and our, uh, our great program facility. When we built the building here in 1996, um, the dream at that time was to have a full program center with a swimming pool. The dedication of the Nellie Hayes Friendship Bridge and the dedication of this pool and this annex is really a culmination of, of a 14-year dream. So we're really excited. We are delighted to have a pool because a pool adds a lot. It enhances the Girl Scout leadership experience because it adds a way for a girl to learn to swim. Learning to swim is an incredible way for a girl to become self-reliant and very confident. Girls can also connect with others, have fun in, in a safe place. Girls will be able to enjoy one of the most popular of sports, which is swimming. So it's a great healthy activity for us to encourage. And girls are also engaged with learning water safety. In our area, we have so many access points for water that it is really paramount that we teach and role model um, water safety. And we, that's one of our promises that we do at all of our camps is we can teach girls to swim so they're confident swimmers and they, they role model that safety aspect. It's a, it's a beautiful pool. The pool is uh, 50 feet long by 25 feet wide. Uh, it goes from the depth of two feet to five feet. And uh, the capacity of the pool is 40 girls. And uh, we're so excited about this because, as Camille said, we can get, teach water safety, swimming lessons, and they can just come out here and have fun. Uh, all they have to do is walk across the bridge. Uh, also, we don't have to worry about going out and trying to find a pool, rent a pool. It's right here. So it, uh, will, uh, uh, it's not only more convenient uh, for the staff and the girls, it will also save uh, money uh, that we can use in other programs. camper here myself. I remember being on lookout the back bay windows and seeing the boardwalk to the outback not even completed yet. We had nothing except for the main building. No pool. Um, I don't remember if we went somewhere or not, but if we did, it was the same rented one as before. But these girls today have so much more. They've gotten a whole lot. A lot more than I ever had. And I think they enjoy it more because it's all theirs. And they have a lot more to explore and have fun with.